This man really getting McDonald's, huh? <laughs> Gotta keep the bulk going, man. Oh yeah, bulk mode, dirty bulk mode. Hey, what's going on, guys? We just finished a push day. Feeling good, feeling pumped, feeling full. Um, my fridge is empty, my stomach is hungry, and all these right down the road, so I figured now is a great time. A lot of you guys have been requesting this. Uh, so we're gonna go do a little grocery vlog haul, grocery haul vlog, one of the two. Uh, show you guys exactly what I stock up on, what goes in my fridge, and ultimately what goes into my stomach so I can stay lean most of the year round. Uh, like I said, a lot of you guys have been requesting this, so I figured now is the perfect time. All these about a five to ten minute drive down the road, so we'll be there in just a second. We'll pick up and continue this video when we arrive, but man, right now we're in McDonald's parking lot with my shooter, Devin. <laughs> Devin Thompson picking up some Mac Shack, and I can't lie, that sounds so good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to steal one of your fries or nuggets or something. Psych. You got some sweet and sour sauce too. So I'm no. like, oh man. Just, just a half a nugget. Half a nugget. <laughs> half a nugget. But yeah, um, so we're gonna go do a grocery haul vlog at Aldi, show you guys, like I said, what I stock up on and what I eat to stay lean year round. Um, yeah, that's basically it for the intro. I'm gonna keep it short and sweet, straight to the point. Um, but guys, shout out Young LA. No, no, no. <laughs> But hey, we're gonna start getting consistent on YouTube. I'm gonna start pushing for at least one or two uploads per week. We got some exciting stuff in store, so do me a favor, hit that sub button below, give me a little sub, and we are going to enjoy this journey together. So let's get started. We'll see you guys when we hit all. How you feel eating McDonald's on a vlog? That's yeah. about staying shredded. <laughs> Bro, I, I am shreddy, so I'm chilling. Oh, you know uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I can't lie. That smells so good. Don't move. Nah, nah, you touched it. Let me get, let me grab wow. it. Wow. It's because I'm black, huh? I got it. Wow, bro. <laughs> I got to take one fry. I think I'm taking a whole other opposite, bro. I'm, I don't even think I'm going the right way. Take a left up here. You said right? That was delicious. You said right? Can I get half a nugget, too? <laughs> no, uh -huh. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Mmm! All right, so we just got to Aldi, and if you guys have ever shopped here, you guys know you need a quarter for a cart. Unfortunately, none of us got a quarter on us, so we're gonna have to sit outside. Uh, hopefully, someone will just give us a cart, or not, I'm gonna give them a dollar for one. So, let's go start this shopping spree. It is cold, it is muy frío outside. I think we're rocking with like 15 degrees, maybe a little lower today, so. Don't wanna sit out here for too long. Don't wanna sit out here for too long. And our victim, whose cart, whose cart are we gonna take? Oh, here's one coming, here's one coming. <laughs> Hello. I don't have a quarter, so can I just take your car for a dollar? Oh, please. Oh, are you sure? Absolutely. Oh, thank you very much. I appreciate it. What a nice lady. She didn't want to take my dollar. What a sweetheart. What a sweetheart. All right, so I don't got a set routine of what I get. I just walk in, and the things I like to get and the things I see, I get first. So. Of course, we're gonna have to grab some blueberries because these are just a hitter. No question there, blueberries always fire. Yeah. <laughs> so first, I guess we're getting berries. I always wanna inspect them. I guess I didn't look at the blueberries. Make sure they're fresh, make sure they're good. This one looks solid. Blueberries and raspberries should be good on fruit other than, uh, actually I'm gonna grab some apples as well. My favorite apples. You take a guess, Devin. What apples do you think I like? Green, because you're weird. Nope. <laughs> so my apples are actually on this side, I think. No? No, they're not. Hmm. All right, we're looking, we're looking for Honeycrisp. Secret revealed. Let's see, we got Sweet Tango, Envy, Jazz, Granny Smith. Ah, here we go. Honeycrisp tote. See, like, that, I don't like that stuff. But the rest of the bag looks good, so I'm just probably gonna switch it out. That one looks pretty solid. Get a little honey crisp tote. These apples, so delicious, so juicy. Honestly, I like apples and bananas. You're gonna have to get some of those, too. Uh, for a little pre-workout snack, those are always nice. Walking by this area is so tempting. Like, look at this. Does that not look mouth-watering? Oh my God, a little drizzle. Oh, oh my God. All this, we're skipping it all. Skipping it all. Gotta stay strict, man. We found the bananas. These, pre-workout, fire. Quick carbs, quick digesting. Uh, a little peanut butter with it too, I love that. 
Are these organic or no? Nope, regular bananas, okay. These are a little too ripe for me. I like them more ready, so if you guys don't know the yellow ones, those are more ready to eat or will be sooner. The ones that are green are a little ripe. You gotta wait about a couple days to a week until they're ready to go. So once they're this color, maybe even a little more yellow. Now these look solid, they're ready to go. And I like to eat them right away, so I'm gonna get the yellow pair. And then we will move on. Absolutely gonna need some jalapeno peppers. I'm a spicy guy, I love my spices. Anything that makes the food more hot, muy caliente, makes it much better in my opinion. These are 95 cents for like three, four, five, six of them. So you can't go wrong there. Oh, I'm sorry about that. It's okay. <laughs> my apologies. Um, guys. <laughs> um, not only does Aldi have great food, high quality foods and all the stuff I like to eat, but it's all at affordable pricing, super cheap. Like I usually fill up my cart and I never spend more than 200 bucks. So that's a solid deal in my opinion. Most of the time it's like 150 or less for a cart full. So you can't go wrong with Aldi. If you haven't tried it, definitely recommend you checking it out. Like Takis, or the Aldi brand Taquitos, not as good, but man, I am such, I mean, Takis and Taquitos are a weakness of mine, but you know, it's a video on how to stay shredded and get lean, so you can't grab those. But man, I really do wish I could. Oh, those make my mouth water just like that cake over there did. Hey, yo. <laughs> it's good. This aisle and that aisle back there, the poultry is where my protein's at. I'm not gonna hit that yet. To the left, we got some coffee, which is absolutely essential and necessary when you're cutting, when you're staying lean, losing weight. Especially for me, I need that caffeine, that extra energy boost. Because when you're running into deficit, you might get a little slower, you might not have as much energy. Good news is I got plenty of coffee at the crib, so I don't gotta stock up on that, but normally I would grab some coffee. So you can never go wrong with some old fashioned oats. Again, this is quick digesting carbs. Another good pre-workout snack. I love to put a scoop of alpha lion protein in here, code WIC to save 50%, and also some peanut butter to make it even more tasty. Cause this, just this, is a little bland for me, not much taste. Um, but other than carbs, it's got some good soluble and dietary fiber in here. Um, so that is honestly a huge plus. You're gonna want that. So that's a good carb source. You gotta do the whole grain cereal, man. Crispy oats. This is the only cereal I will eat. And it's like, honestly, once or twice a week, especially when I'm cutting. If I'm not cutting, you know, I'll grab a couple boxes of Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Uh, I'll grab some Fruit Loops, the off-brand kind, cause all these sells like some different type of shit. And then uh, maybe those cookie ones, those look good too. But when I'm cutting, trying to stay lean, only the crispy oats. You talking about those? Yeah. Yeah, these, mm, like just look at those. And these two, boy. I mean, bro, you can't go wrong. But staying lean, you want that whole grain cereal. You want that whole grain cereal. It's a lot of work, man. You gotta be strict. See, like, as strict as spending $4 on a little thing of peanut butter because it's natural, it's organic. Uh, and that's the way you wanna go when you're trying to chase a lean more aesthetic physique. So we're gonna go with the natural creamy peanut butter. It's super weird, guys, because look at all the liquid up top. It's like, ugh. Stop faking it, bro. But you just mix it up, and it's all good. You don't even notice it's there after a little while. But that's why you wanna go down. Again, peanut butter and your oats with a scoop of protein, absolute hitter. Take my word for it, don't take my word for it. But I'm telling you guys. Mm. My favorite rice, bag of jasmine. Check it out, fourth cup is only 160 calories, 60, 36 grams, excuse me, of carbs, three grams of protein. And that's all you're looking for is carbs and protein. One fourth cup, 160 calories. This shit, ugh, this shit's delicious. Dude, I feel like I shouldn't be swearing, but like half of me is like, you know, fuck it. I'm trying to stay clean for the audience, but sometimes it's not, uh, I don't even know where I'm going with that. <laughs> so we got good ground beef at the crib, but I'm gonna have to grab another one since I run through it so quick. I'm always going 93.7, it's the most lean they sell here. Um, actually, psych, I see a 96.4 and I swear they used to 
Devin. <laughs> Dude. 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 Uh, we're just having a blast. <laughs> we're shooting a little YouTube video. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, 96.4. It's the leanest they sell here. It must be new because I only used to see 93.7, but no, my bad. Since they got that option, we're going to take them up on it. Let's see. Four ounces, 140 calories, 24 grams of protein. Psh, cheat code, man. It's cheat code, no question. <laughs> it's bad. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. No, you're good. These tenderloin, these are my favorite. Probably gonna have to go with like two of these because you can never have enough chicken. Uh, I've got chicken breasts at the crib. Uh, 93.7 lean ground turkey. That's a must. Probably grab two of those. And then uh, some all natural ground chicken. Lean ground chicken. Cause sometimes you get tired of the breast and tenderloins. You wanna have something different. So that's the route you go down. We'll take a look at the macros over here. Four ounces, 150 calories, 20 grams of protein in the ground chicken, in the ground turkey, lean ground turkey, 22 grams of protein, 160 calories for four ounces. A little bit of sodium, that's totally fine. Mmm. This is where the protein's at. And then the tenderloins, one tenderloin's 110 calories only, 26 grams of protein. So this is honestly probably all the protein we're gonna need. Uh, should get me through a week or two, and uh, then we'll be back for some more. Just to be safe, I'm gonna grab a thing of chicken breast too. Can never have enough protein, or too much protein, I should say. I don't really like those big, thick ones, because sometimes you don't cook them enough or you cook them too long. I like the tenderloins, little thin ones, you can throw them in a frying pan. These like must go in the oven or on the grill. I'm not grilling, it's too cold this time of the year. In Minnesota, it gets chilly. So we're just gonna stick with the tenderloins. Usually I'd stop and get some water, but we got like two or three cases at the house, so don't need to grab that right now. Um, but on the right side, where is it at? Aha! For breakfast, instead of just eggs and egg whites, I like to add a little turkey bacon to it. More flavor. And the macros are great. Let's see, one slice is only 30 calories, two grams of protein, and 2.5 grams of fat. So this is real good. Yes, sir. Oh, normally, I'd also grab some cottage cheese and some Greek yogurt, but I also got those at the house. So I'm not gonna grab those, but normally I would. I love my cottage cheese, love my Greek yogurt. If the Greek yogurt's too plain for you, throw a little bit of granola in there, not too much, because it is pretty heavy in carbs, and then throw some blueberries, bananas, and raspberries. Oh my gosh, it makes it 10 times better. 10 times better. Yep. You guys already know, I'm gonna have to grab some protein yogurt. Let's see. Vanilla. Mixed berry. I'm a berry dude. I'm a very berry dude. Um, so we're gonna do the mixed berry kind. Macros on this. One container, seven grams of carbs, 15 grams of protein. So you can't go wrong with that. Slice 130 grams. Yeah. If you don't have too much of it. Yeah. yeah. It's like you said, it's a little flavor. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Should have a code for turkey bacon. Do a little discount. Boom. For my milk, it's always almond milk. I have it in moderation though. Almond milk's the way, better than original milk in my opinion. I just like the thick creaminess of it. Hey, yo! Uh, 60 hey, calories. <laughs> mm, what? <laughs> 60 <laughs> calories, one cup, eight grams of carbs, one gram of protein. So it's not bad. And then uh, I run through this quick, so I'm gonna grab two two cartons of these liquid egg whites. For three tablespoons, it's only 25 calories and five grams of protein. So that's a, that's a win right there. Liquid egg whites, I usually mix one or two whole eggs with about a half cup or a cup of these each morning. And then I have some turkey bacon with it and that is my breakfast. If not, it'll just be simply oats mixed with protein, berries, and peanut butter. All right, so instead of just the liquid egg whites, like I said, you need some whole eggs with that. So we're gonna grab two of these. 
it's honestly crazy how much the price has gone up on these. 403 for a dozen eggs, grade A large. I mean, they're not even cage free organic, which is insane. Prices, inflation, everything is going up, man. Everything is going up. <laughs> This one's looking much better. Um, honestly, we're looking solid right now. We're looking solid. I got shrimps and scallops at home. Those are some of my favorite seafoods. Oh, I need to grab some salmon. Brussels sprouts I got. Um, normally, oh yeah, you guys might be like, where is his greens? Where is his veggies? Does this dude not eat vegetables? So my vegetables come from supplement. I supplement green vegetables from Alpha Lion. Um, it's a scoop of greens each morning. It comes with a whole bunch of stuff and I'll actually show you guys what that looks like when I get back to the house. Um, but yeah, one scoop of that every morning, it basically get my whole vegetable intake in for the day. Again, if you do want to check that out, I'll drop a link in the description, alphalion.com. Um, and you can use code WIQ, W-I-Q-Q, -Q, for 15% off your purchase. As well as if you like this jacket, these joggers, or this crew neck. Also got a Young LA code for you guys, code WIQ, W-I-Q-Q, -Q, save 15%. Young LA is trending, it is taking over the game, the fitness industry, the lifestyle industry. They're just taking over. YLA on top, baby, you know what I mean? So guys, that's basically it for our shopping haul. We got our protein, we got our carbs, we got our fats, and again, the vegetables, I supplement every morning, just a scoop, and I get my full daily vegetable intake in from supplementing it. So no greens, no veggies here, but I do got it at the house in a supplement form. I can show you guys that later. Uh, we're gonna go check out now. Short and sweet, it was that quick. Bing bong. Probably gonna be less than 150 bucks, which is not bad at all. For all the food I'm getting here, this will hold me over for a couple weeks at least. And 150 bucks, man, you can't go wrong with that. You go to Costco, Sam's Club, Walmart, Target, you're spending over two, 250 on all this stuff, I'm telling you. All these got the deals. They got the deals for real. Uh, uh, uh. That's all. That's all. Price guessing. Less than 150, I'm guessing. What you think? Matter of fact, I'm gonna guess exactly 127. What's tax? Sure. Um, I'm guessing 127 total. I'm gonna say 146. 146? Ooh, just a smidge below 150. We'll see. We'll see. Uh-oh. Who <laughs> said uh-oh? What did I say, 126? Yeah. Let's see what we got. We got two minutes left on this battery. Oh, the SD card. Uh-oh. We stop it for now. We got all the bags at the house, so I'll probably need, what, like three? Three? Probably had these two. Thank you. Yeah, you don't need to close. How much? Oh, look at that. Less than a hundred. That's what I'm telling you. All these are places to go. Right? All these. <laughs> Thank you very much. Give yourself a good day. Thank you. Hey, we got our quarters now. We got our quarters. <laughs> Alright, let me get situated. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Guys, so that was basically it. That's all the stuff I normally get when I go shopping. I eat this mostly year round, unless I'm balking or unless I feel like cheating. I'll grab some other sweets, some other goods um, that I wouldn't normally eat, but I, that I do highly enjoy when I'm not cutting or staying strict. Um, so I'm just gonna pack this up, head back to the house, start to meal prep for the week so I got all this good food to eat. Um, I like to do it all in one day, one or two days, get all the meal prep done, um, just so I'm not constantly cooking every day. Uh, and then yeah, I'm gonna enjoy that for the next week or two. Hey, you guys stay tuned, we got some exciting stuff in store. If you haven't already, drop a like, hit that subscription button below, and we'll see you guys soon. Peace.